Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to iTouch App Reviewers. We are just over eight days from WWDC 2018, uh, so just wanted to put that out there because I'm getting super excited about it. Can't wait to see what Apple unveils. But today, uh, I'm going to talk about iOS 12, which will be unveiled at WWDC this year. But anyways, iOS 12 to allow iPhones to unlock doors via NFC. Uh, Apple is expected to expand NFC capabilities of its iPhones beyond mobile payments, allowing users to securely unlock doors equipped with the technology, according to the information. It's said to be planning to announce the new functionality next month, suggesting it will come at WWDC as part of iOS 12 unveiling. Change to the near field uh, communication or NFC chip, which is expected to be announced next month, could pave the way for people to use iPhones for other security sensitive interactions from paying transit fares and opening car doors to verifying their identity in other ways. Now I can see this being used um, in Tesla's, even though I think something similar is already being used with Bluetooth. Um, but anyways, already employees at Apple's new campus in Cupertino, California are using their iPhones to gain access to buildings and offices, suggesting that the technology has been deployed there. People familiar with the matter said. The information reported nearly four years ago that Apple was looking to expand NFC capabilities to building security and transit ticketing, working with its campus security vendor, HID Global, on the technology. Today's report notes that while Bluetooth is already used to manage some smart locks using iPhones, NFC offers a more secure method for connections and authentication, an important consideration for companies and government agencies in particular. So I can see this being a huge deal. Uh, and if I go over to this story here over on 9to5Mac, it's pretty much the same thing, but iOS 12 will reportedly include new NFC features, enable iPhones to become secure hotel room keys. Now, that would be awesome. Uh, when I get my hands on this beta, I know I'm going to probably be traveling quite a bit and I'll probably be in multiple hotels. It would be awesome to just be able to use my phone, tap the door and have it unlock instead of fiddling around trying to find that stupid key uh, that most people tend to lose. Um, but yeah, I think it would be so awesome to be able to use this uh, to scan into a room and just easily access a hotel room or whatever. So I can see people using this for transit uh, if you take buses and stuff like that. I can see this being used for many different things. Uh, so this is pretty much the same report here. They wanted to, the iPhone to be used in more contactless interactions beyond Apple Pay, like acting as a hotel door key or as a virtual transit card for easier transportation. Apple started down this road with iOS 11 by adding the core NFC framework. This framework allows apps to use the NFC chip as an arbitrary scanner of RFID tags, however, is very limited. As well as not supporting write access, the main drawback of the current NFC APIs is that the app must be in the foreground. The app must present a specific system modal sheet to start scanning. So you can see that right there. Yeah, this obviously limits the cases and convenience of the feature. What the information describes is something more sophisticated where an iPhone owner would simply tap their phone on a door lock to get into their hotel room. So that would be super cool to not even have to like unlock the phone. Well, maybe you'd have to unlock it or at least have it scan your face uh, just to show that it's you, but to not even have to like open an app or anything, just, you know, tap your phone next to this thing, have the door unlocked, that'd be sick. So we will have to see about that. Uh, if Apple does expand on this, I really hope they do because NFC is something that Apple really doesn't touch on too much. Uh, I mean, besides Apple Pay, which I personally don't even use yet, uh, just haven't seen a use for it. There's not enough places that take it. Uh, I think this will be an awesome uh, upgrade. If iOS 12 really does do this, I can't wait to get on the public beta and start testing that, um, especially if hotels adopt this quickly or other places, uh, that would be super cool. So let me know your guys' thoughts on this down below in the comments. Uh, I think this is a huge change and I think something that will be welcomed by pretty much everyone uh, just because who wouldn't want more ease of use with NFC? So iOS 12, uh, if you want my predictions, obviously the developer beta, beta one, will be released on June 4th. Um, so if you're a developer, you wanna pay the 100 bucks, you can get in on it. If you don't wanna pay the 100 bucks, there are usually sketchy links that you can download and install the profile on your phone, just be aware that those people that host those could have injected malicious code into that, that you are now installing on your device. So I personally would never do that. I would much rather just pay the hundred bucks. But what I actually do is I just wait two to three weeks uh, until they release the public beta, the first public beta. Now, should you ever install this on your daily driver phone? Absolutely not. Do I always do it? Pretty much. Yeah, I do. Uh, and I make videos on it because that's what I enjoy doing. I enjoy uh, going through this software, finding the changes, making videos for you guys. And uh, I don't know, it's kind of like a scavenger hunt to see what there is, but it will probably crash a lot of apps. A lot of stuff won't work. It probably won't connect to my car with Bluetooth. I always have issues with that with first betas for some reason. There's always just these little bugs and annoyances, but if that's something you can deal with, then well, go for it. I ain't going to stop you. But that's all I got for this video, guys. Drop a comment down below on if you want to see iOS 12 expand on NFC capabilities on the iPhone, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thumbs up, subscribe, peace.